I just got three new boxes in. Car parts for the Starlet. Suspension parts. But let's open it. Oh, shit, the box cutter's right here. You wanna hold that for me? All right, first we got this one. This one's from Hawaii. Uh, I'll show you guys what it is. It's probably not beautiful. It's probably rusted because it's from Hawaii. Why are you laughing? Right you can't say things like that. Huh? It's probably rusted because it's from Hawaii. I just keep it real. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty rusted. Check that out. How nasty is that? The brakes and the whole brake hardware with this, the brake duster that has the bracket too. So this is something I really need. And it's crazy because I paid like 125 for all of this, but the guy, I mean, uh, the ones I've seen locally were like a hundred dollars for two of these and like a hundred something bucks for two brake calipers. So I saved a lot of money there. I'm pretty sad he didn't send the hubs. I need to talk to him because that's not cool. I don't even want that. Nasty. Uh, this one that's right here, gross. this one is from, uh, what is it? It says Toyota of Lake City. I bought this from 86 Legends. Um, and what it is, it's a whole hub setup. So, I mean, it's a whole, uh, wheel bearing uh, re re repair kit or something like that where it's all new bearings and all new pieces and parts everything for the hubs you know new new pieces for the center of the the hubs it's all patch of grease lock washers or something like that what is this some washer yeah washer claw and uh some other stuff bearing so this whole bearing kit and cotter pins. So that's that. Last box. This is, this is what I might return because what I ordered from Hawaii had the hubs in it too for a whole deal. But um, I guess he didn't send it. So I need to message him after this. But I bought these on eBay. Or I, this guy, I saw found this guy selling some stuff but in Hawaii. Oh shit, these are nasty. Ew, he left lint in here. <laughs> this is from a fucking uh, dryer. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> Hold on, it's... See good. the difference? Oh my god. Yeah. Ew. Is there like... There's, ew. Oh shit, I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, so... I'm gonna go message the guy in Hawaii about my hubs because he's supposed to send that. And then this fool right here, I don't know, someone might wanna buy it. I might clean them up and sell them or just try to return them. But those are all the parts that I got. Those are all the parts that I got recently for, uh, for the Starlet. So this is gonna go on the Fortune Auto coilovers that are over there. Can't really see them. So the suspension, yeah, the new suspension. It's gonna ride really good. Are we re, re going? Yeah. Okay. Batters died. Hi, my name is David. Is it recording? Oh yeah, it is, sorry. Okay. <laughs> so I have all the hardware for this you guys saw in the last video. I think I put it in the last clip, right? I, I don't fucking know. So today we're <laughs> gonna clean this up. Or these two hubs. We're gonna clean them. And we're going to pretty much redo everything. Look at that. When the dude shipped it to me, it had freaking uh, had a clothing dust lint. bunny clothing lint <laughs> in it. Don't ask why I kept that corgi hair down there <laughs> in the window. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna be um, cleaning this up, and uh, I don't have any new wheel studs, so I might have to get new wheel studs. But yeah, the insides are gonna get cleaned out. Um, I think all the hardware is in here still, but I don't need the hardware because I got a box full of new hardware in here. So, this is a time lapse of uh, us cleaning it. Now. So first off, what we're gonna do, flip yours over, and we're gonna take this off. How do we do it? Nope. Let's figure out how to nope. take this off. <laughs> 
this? It was like gold before. Yeah, I think they spray painted it gold or copper or something like that. Okay, so since it's not coming off, what we're gonna do is, I'll be right back. We'll grab a hammer and a flathead. So we can chisel it out through the sides. Here, we're gonna dig it up. Okay, we don't need that. I don't think that's a bearing right there. We don't need that as well. So why don't you put it in here so I can take it out there in a way? We'll just leave it there for now. Okay, what I want you to do, take this right here. You see inside it? Mm -hmm. Okay, hold that. Yes. Oh, you're right handed? Mm -hmm. Okay, hold this with your left, and you're gonna have it right there, right about there, and you're gonna take this, and you hit down, tap it, okay? This little thing right here. So, you're gonna go from the bottom, I'm sorry, look in here, right here, see this? No. Yeah. Yeah, so, hold oh, it right okay. there, and then you're gonna knock it out. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hold it, yep. There you go. You get it? Yep. Ah. So that's that. That's the whole assembly right there. All right. So we're back in the garage. And today what we did was take off the outer, I don't know what this ring is called for the, the wheel bearings. It's a pain in the ass because we had to hammer those out on both sides. So now it's out. I'm clean it up now. But here's all, not all the parts, but I want to show you a, the old, the old bearings and bolts and everything and the washers and the outer caps and the new, the new ones that I got from, uh, Toyota 86 Legend something, something. Yeah, so, <laughs> I forgot, it's somewhere. But, yeah, so, you can see everything right there. Look at that. All the old stuff. Look how grimy that looks. I don't know. <laughs> Who's walking? Look at that. Outer steel. Look at that. That is grimy. <laughs> Jesus. But yeah, this is just for one side. I do have the rest in here. So that's going to get all pressed in today into these clean hubs that we clean it's a lot better than how they looked yesterday yes and then we want to pack them with grease which i gotta go find the grease so let's go find the grease and put it together and i got a tool that i rented too from uh AutoZone, which is gonna press all these in so it should be good to go rented this today it's a bearing race and seal driver set and what that's gonna do is press in these rings for the bearings into the hubs so brand new ones fresh is it focusing mm -hmm. okay and this is what comes in this kit you know go to your O'Reilly's or AutoZone and you can just rent it out and uh, you just get your money back once you return it. If you don't rent it, I mean return it, then uh, you're buying it pretty much. So this is what I'm going to use to put them in. So let's do that. Grab the correct ones to fit. See that? Is it recording? Yeah, you're moving too fast. Oh, so what you do is you go to the box and you grab your ring and you just find which one fits inside and see that one right there fits so this is going to be for the outer the outer seal so what we're going to do is i don't think we lube it up let's pop it inside i'm going to take this and then so see how it sits flush right there and there 
We're gonna grab our tool. I mean the other end, the handle. Unscrew it. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Take this out. Boom. Screw this bad boy in. Good. Okay. Now we're gonna move down to the ground and do this. So I'm gonna pound it. Hold it straight. Got my mallet here. Straight in. Still not done yet. We got a long way to go. My man's not going in. Okay, so got these boys hammered in using that tool. Did the other side as well too. Blam. There you go. So currently I do not have the brake rotors and the pads, so I'm waiting for that to get in from AutoZone. Then I can install everything here, but this is pretty much Clean that up a little bit, got a little bit of space on it. The dirty, dirty boys. I gotta lube it up. Lube it up and then. Blam, blam. It's gonna be fresh and brand new. We pack it with grease after. So just lubing it up the, the bearing right now. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. Work it, work it everywhere. You laughing at me? <laughs> Put this on this right there. What? It's funny. How far are you going to be? I'm not sure. I think it's seated flush on it. And you see, that is it right there. <laughs> so we took it for our last cruise today, for now. And now we're, what we're gonna do is jack up the car, put on jack stands, and bolt up the coilovers because we're still waiting for the brake rotors, which will be here tomorrow, roughly around 1 p.m. So we just gotta wait a little bit, then we can finish up the rest of this task. 